HLB has it. It probably. K9 is, we got cheers from the crowd, K9. Yeah, we have a bit of a crowd gathering for this one. Right? We got Charlie in the background. We got Bahamut watching on. We got Elegant right behind him. Cheering him on. I hope that's not picking up. <laughs> I mean, if it is, you can't help it. Right. It is what it is. Very rowdy smash play. So assuming we're getting this Meat Brawler Wolf matchup, what do you make of the way these two characters would interact? I, I would assume that HLB would uh, go for the cheesy. Actually, yes, he can. Right. <laughs> uh, Charlie the King really wants to commentate this match because, you know, they have their little rivalry going on. So I'll let him do what he wants. So we'll be welcoming Charlie to the headset in just a moment. As we get K9's HLB started. Getting into this match. What's up, guys? It's Charlie. What's up, Bronkopoulos? Pleasure commentating with you yesterday. Anyway, getting into this, we got <laughs> the storyline match. Is this your stuff? Uh, mine is. Yours is yours. I got it with the parry, but didn't parry the second hit of that upbeat. That upbeat is frame five, and it reaches a great distance. So even, I don't know if Max Wolf Space Fair gets punished by it, but regular one definitely does. I believe Max Space Fair does and Max Space F Tilt doesn't, so that might be just a winning combination for him if he wants to stay grounded. And right now, HLB, small lead into this game one. Ooh, tried to catch that landing there, but Sean drifted, or K9 drifted a little bit further with that Nair. Caught him off guard. Back up smash on top of the platform. Wolf is gonna live. This attack on the platform, but HLB went for a read that wasn't quite there. Got him with the upbeat, quite kill. Nice reflect on that neutral B. HLB facing backwards, goes for the grab. The forward throw, dodges the neutral B. Oh, it's going to be the first stock going to HLB. Shot put connecting, and K9's already a stock down, already in a bit of trouble. Ooh, good combo. All right, HLB punishing those full hops with that upbeat, recognizing can I like to be in the air a little bit there? Got him with that in air into down tilt into, I believe that's, what move is that? The, the spin, that's the forward air, right? I believe so. Not dark, but not getting any out of that back air is gonna poke, putting him for 111. Tried to go for the like extremely risky spike on that up B. That would have been quite the, the statement from HLB, but K9 is gonna avoid it there. Let's see if he's gonna be able, if he's gonna be able to tack on the percent he needs. The weight and fall speed of Brawler throwing him off there with that down throw dash attack. He does kind of look like a floaty character, but no. Oh, trying to read the air dodge there. He's, he's very much middle of the road in both weight and fall speed. He is your pretty much average character, and most people, most characters don't respect him. Ooh, now out of shield there. That is a very, trying to read a tech in. But to punch that with the jab out of shield, too slow. Bounce off the platform on that up B there. a is just charging with some of these back airs. Kind of the cannon's very playing very like reserved. He doesn't want to uh, get too close. Okay, we now gonna go off stage. Peter versus the shot put after imagine that was not intentional. But another one's gonna connect. He has to expend his jump early. HLB right now is putting on that pressure. Has K9 corner, but K9 that landing there not quite gonna take it. Let's see how K9's gonna get off the ledge. Caught that dash in with the forward smash. Now K9's in the driver's seat. Across the stage, HLB still with a percent lead, but after that's going to be a stock. Yeah, but that's going to be it. Now, a full stock ahead. K9 goes once for right off the end of the platform with the grab attempt. Caught that neutral, got up with that grab. Let's see if K9's going to be able to convert a stock off this sledge trap. He needs to be able to take the stock as soon as he can. He caught that landing with that up smash. K9 evening up this game. Runs forth and gets that wide scooping hitbox, the back hitbox as well. It reaches exactly as far as the forward hitbox, which many characters don't respect it for. All right, got him with that grab, down throw, F tilt. Goes to the tech change with that dash tech. It didn't dash quite far enough. Jab, putting him up to 25. Another upbeat this time scattered out by K9. He will play with that trade with that forward air. And now K9 has the percent lead in this game one. Wow, the reversal from the ledge. Using that massive hitbox on Nair to, to get his to force his way on, on HLV. HLV's not gonna bite with those forward smashes. Taking his time at the ledge there. A good holding shield onto that back air. That would have been very close to killing from the side platform. 
Ooh, that, ooh, Sean. Or K9 with the, with, the, with the reaction on that tech chase. Both these players just nearing, spacing theirs on shield. Right, but it's gonna roll outward. Ooh, tried to, oh, he had the read, but he didn't execute properly. Went for the high wolf flash. Not gonna die for it. Right now, pretty much in the game. Went for the anti up smash on shield. Maybe he thought he was gonna jump. Oh, that's gonna be? No, no, it's not. Oh, definitely weak. Not quite that strong. But the long range snipe with a shot put is gonna put game one into HLB's lap. HLB clutching that first game versus K9. Right when K9 looked like he was in the driver's seat. Went for that up smash on shield. You know, he went, thought he was gonna jump, thought he was gonna press a button, but HLB just stayed in shield, punished him, got him with that up B, and then threw the, what is it called? The shot put. The shot put off stage. <laughs> Neutral B. It's such a goofy projectile, but it really works out. It led to two of HLB's three kills, and the arc that it covers for Wolf is really annoying when you're covering. It sort of forces you to put yourself into unnatural situations where some of the firewolf angles are a bit more out of the ordinary. Right. Right now, HLB up 1-0 in this very important set. <laughs> Not just important bracket-wise, but these, these two were beefing on Twitter over the ranking. There, There is more than a spot in winner's quarters on the line. Definitely. <laughs> HLB's playing this first stock very well, but let's see what how what K9's gonna do to make the adjustments. Wow, just with these snares trying to catch his wolf jumps. But K9 right now. Got him with the up air forward air combo. Catching his jump with that back air. Going high. This time the nair coming from HLB sends him in the reverse direction. Awkward position to be in. K9 once again at the ledge. Caught the neutral getup with the up beat. Double back on the jump, and that will move him directly into HLB's outstretched foot with the back attack. HLB's ledge trapping right now is on point. He's just ready for these jumps, ready for these neutral get ups. He's all over him. K9 got him with that sour near. Missed time to get down smash by a little bit. That just goes to show the fine margins in this matchup. One missed timing, a couple of frames in either direction can make the difference as K9's goes forward with that Nair. Excellent Nair coming back from the stage. A little bit of a, of a risky dare, but he's not gonna die for it. And if it did hit, it would've been the stock. So respect. But HLB off stage a bit late on that two frame. Expected him to land on him, but instead landed on the platform. And he's gonna punch that upbeat with his own up smash. K9 taking the first stock of the second game. Of course, what, what a response directly afterward from HLB with a back air. Answering back right away, right as he responds with that jump read. A lot of people tend to jump. It's like a new role in this game because of how quick it is. Especially with Wolf's crazy aerial drift. You can just jump away and drift. I mean, it's absolutely to be expected when you have so many aerials with that middle end left. Right. Ooh, HLB right now. Down tilt, forward air. Down tilt, forward air once again. And the ball extension off the platform. But K9 turns seven back to neutral. K9 has to be very careful. Every time HLB's touched him, it's been plenty of damage. Read the jump, but K9's gonna fastball with that Nair. Oh my goodness, just out of the range of the F-Smash. This is a good attempt by K9, but HLB a little bit too far for it. Nice Nair into grab, down throw. Good DI from HLB, DI the down throw up at, to avoid getting tech chase or sent off stage. Right back into the grab though. K9's reactions right now on shield are perfect. He re reacts to your shielding at a certain range, immediately goes for that grab. Caught him with that Nair, I believe, or was that for? I think it was Nair into down smash. Yeah. Second place read. I mean, I don't believe HLB is really teched out of, outward or in with once. He's rolled outward. He I does like the second place a lot. Has to him up quite low capacity. Ooh, got him with that spot dodge down tilt. Once again, the dash egg. HLB, HLB does not want any extra damage tacked onto him until he takes his stock. But K9, let's see what he has to say about that. Four air down throw dash tag, 37 damage on the board. Almost getting rid of shield, and that time he has nothing to do but get hit. Actually, he gets hit with a lingering hitbox of the shot. Very <laughs> 167 sent him absolutely nowhere. Can I recognize that he can play safe right now? Does not want to lose his stock. Like, this stock is so important. Got him with an up B, caught his dash in, and that's going to be the second stock on HLB. Drop up through a fair, we'll put him up to 71. Quite the match happening right now. K9 in the lead, 81% on HLB. K9 had him cornered, but right now, resets to neutral, tried to read a jump. Second of F smashes, this time HLB gonna jump over both of them. Has to find a way to maneuver around these lasers. Once again, K9 getting a sour spot of down smash. If only he hadn't dashed as far. 
but still firmly in command of this second game. Over oh, HMB's gonna be able to turn around, or if K9's gonna continue his pressure, try to read the jump there. Over 80% in the lead. Tech rolls in from K9. HLB did not cover Ooh. that option. Guys right now playing clean neutral. Staying at the correct range. Gets punished there. Oh, that could have been it! Just before that up smash came out, you could see the scoop hitbox was already active, but the auto smash, the second hitbox, did not have time to come out. And right now, caught that neutral get up with the grab. This is looking like a dire situation for HLB. Is he going to be able to get off the ledge alive? And he is! And an air to grab actually will over the situation. Oh. Red to jump in with the air dodge. Oh! Yeah. HLB! Went for it all with that up B, and k going to be taking that second game. We're going to a game three, folks. He did not just attempt to take the stock. He attempted to take this man's life he right here. He wanted to make a statement, ending the set with an up B, but K9 mixing up with that Wolf Flash. Smart, smart plays. I, I can't say I necessarily disagree with the Gambit when you're already at that sort of percent disadvantage. It is final stock, so it's a, it's a heavy risk, but oh, absolutely, it's a calculated one. At the very least, K9 right now. K9, look of determination. HLB unfazed by that last game. Both of them determined to take this set and move on to winners' quarters of WNF number whatever number this is. A decisive game three in this one. K9's going to start it off with an up throw up air. Smartly going for that up throw up, but not getting the extension on the platform. However, he does not need it. It's 25 damage. Wow, that's interesting. Is he not pressing it quick enough, or is K9 just doing it so low to the ground that HLB is not getting the punish? There is sort of that nebulous zone between the side of the platform and the stage itself, where you kind of have to guess where he's going to land. It's interesting because that 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 forward air is minus six, and if I'm not mistaken, that up B is frame five. Wow, read that just hold that panic shield by HLB, turn around and grab the no fear coming out from K9. Just confident in these grab reads. Trying to go for that little catch there. Good air dodge on the stage. Yeah, necessary one at that. That shot hook was coming for his direction. Woo! Comboed that. <laughs> Once again with that dash attack. Not quite going to take the stock just yet. K9 at dangerous percent. It is launched the other way, but with the man the eye. Gonna kill him earlier than he should have if he reacted, but that is very difficult to react to. It's hard to expect that to send you that way. Second place once again, but K9's not gonna get the not gonna get the punish he needs. Goes high with an air. Now has the opportunity to two frame with a down tilt. Does not do so, but the neutral getup gonna be caught out by the down smash. Catches that neutral getup with the down smash. Incredible play from K9 there. Impeccable timing. Got him with that double back air. 33 damage already on the board. If K9 had immediately jumped after that, he would have got spiked by the up game. Platform, but nowhere safe from that bear from HLB. Look for a tech in there. Look at that landing bear. Right now, this game is, is every game has been close. Once again, hecking in place, but K9's not gonna punish it. Got a weak hit of back air, but still alive. Scary position to be in. Both these players playing so immaculately right now. And looking for these jump ins. HLB's gonna get that grab. He isn't gonna be able to follow up, however. Yeah, he thought HLB was playing cautiously before. Look at how oh. careful he's playing now. Oh my goodness, that was so big. Recognize that K9 likes to burn his double jump the second he gets hit. Red is landing on the platform with the up smash, and he is going to go up in this game three right now. Very decisive. He read that. Two frames off with that forward smash. And now every extra damage he's going to take is going to be detrimental. Over half rage on top of the platform, not going to put him into a tight situation. Landing there, not going to get anything out of it. He'd up smash, he said, though it probably wouldn't have killed. Oh, dangerous! HLB going for that up spike once again. It is a specialty. Dude, HLB right now is going off! And shield once again goes for that same option. What's Kanai going to do? Air dodges. How is he going to take the stock? Does he get hit by that side beat? Fails to punish! 27, dangerous position for Kanine. Let's see if he can make some magic happen. Gets the... Oh, what? That had no way! All right. K9 gonna take that stock. Catching his landing off that battlefield platform. Let's see what K9 is gonna do to bring this back. Certainly difficult, but not impossible with all this deficit to make up. 
Ooh, and that's gonna be HLB 2-1. No fist bump? Interesting I there. think, unless we missed it. Good stuff to both players. That was, Ken I played it so well up until he lost his sock to the, to the landing catch, and then HLB. Yeah, just went way deep for that one, and I think for the second game in a row, we really saw those shot puts not only apply the pressure, not only get the killing blows, but some of, the, some of the ways and some of the angles he was throwing them out beforehand directly sent him